Hey, baby, Sasa, how are you doing? I'm fine. All right, so um, let's start by just tell us about Phoebe. Yeah. About Phoebe. Well, I'm a campus student. Mm -hmm. I study at J Court. Mm -hmm. I'm awesome. doing a bachelor's in uh, microbiology. So yeah, uh, I've always uh, loved music ever since, yeah. and uh, I think I developed an interest in rap music. Uh, I think when I was in class eight, because we performed some song by Jaden Smith and Justin Bieber, "Never Say Never." Mm -hmm. Then there's this two part where Jaden usually raps, so they told me to rap on our prize giving day. Mm -hmm. So after that, I think in the course of high school, I continued uh, loving uh, rap music, though I never actually wrote my own mm -hmm. songs or lyrics. Mm -hmm. And then I think it was in, uh, when we started quarantine, I think it was uh, around uh, May of 2020, yeah. I decided to just start writing my own stuff. Of which we started off with my little sister she used to help me with a lot of them mm -hmm. and then yeah i noticed that i loved traveling yeah. yeah so nice. basically i'm a campus student who's pursuing maybe a career in rapping part time oh, okay. that's, that's amazing that's amazing and um so your your ep is dropping in end of july yeah it's called um Thoughts. Yes. Tell us about thoughts. Well, since it was my, it is my first EP or basically my first project to drop officially. Mm -hmm. I wanted it to come from the heart. Like, if you listen to it, ninety percent of the music I actually wrote from a point of experience. Yeah. There are some songs that are really deep that come from the heart then there are some i'm just talking about make basic things i was feeling at the particular moment but you'll get to maybe feel the type of emotion i was feeling and trying to portray in the different types of song okay. so uh, some okay some of the songs that are there like uh, which one just recently dropped out yeah, um, which was it's called Duckling. The Duckling. Yes. Right? Okay. So, what about Duckling? Well, I think it's my most unapologetic song. Mm -hmm. I think I had, had got into a fallout with some of my close friends. We weren't really talking, mm -hmm. and uh, I was also going through some major changes in my life and. Just a array of emotions that us as youth usually feel but don't really know how to convey. Mm -hmm. So I was just maybe throwing my first frustration in there, but uh, oh, okay. it's majorly just me being me. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah, that, that, a lot of that comes out. <laughs> and um, also, it's amazing, it's really amazing how it, how it, how it brings that unapologetic vibe out. Then, uh, any other song from the album that was dropped? Yeah, there's the first one that dropped, I think it was two weeks ago. Mm -hmm. It's called The uh, New Kid on the Block. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so basically that song is just talking about how I've decided to actually pursue a career in rap music. Mm -hmm. So I'm just trying to introduce the character Phoebe Tester to the world. Yeah, just to give people a taste of who I am, yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's awesome. And who is Phoebe Tester apart from uh, and all the microbiology and the 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 rapping thing? So what vibe are you really getting out? Like where do you understand it? In terms of music. First of all, what about the music? Like the music career, how are you checking it out? It's hard. Being an upcoming musician is actually very hard because uh, 
as my producer usually likes telling me it's a brand that you're selling so you need to know how to promote yourself how to put yourself out there because people won't actually know you because you're not a big name you have to find some connections Mm -hmm. you try to place your song out there so that it can be heard so yeah Uh, what was the other question like okay like the idea of it being hard is it like the promotion part yeah. Uh, the prom- as in putting yourself out there yeah the promotion part because okay let's say you've sent a link in a particular group like mm-hmm. 90% of the people when you send a link people won't actually press the link to actually listen to it mm-hmm. like okay personally I think I've skipped a number of links that someone maybe has put on the statuses <laughs> maybe I tell myself I'll look at it later and I don't so trying to put yourself out there it's actually hard and it takes time people usually think that it's you just start from here and then you just go up but it's it's a journey that uh, it's really hard and you need the support of so many people and hopefully it will pick up yeah, yeah. all right uh, we're certain about that for the type of vibe that you're selling out there i think it's really awesome so we're just going to um, you know play a little bit of that one and also a little bit of new kid on the block okay. yeah then um yeah we'll take some shots and then we'll see how that goes about that that's fine all right let's do that <laughs> 